All right, Dwayne, we're playing hole number 12 out Founders Club. Let's tell our viewers a little bit about this hole. Yeah, so number 12 here is a par five. It's not an extremely long par five, um, but it's a double-sided fairway, so you can take it both routes. Um, you've got front bunkers in the middle, um, which makes it a very you know fun design, very unique to this area. Um, so normally I try to play it down the middle and hit a fade if I can. Uh, we'll see what happens today, but um, not, not the hardest tee shot. But yeah, very fun hole. You got water in the front there that protects the green. But yeah, fun hole. Yeah, this will get in your head a little bit. Yeah, that can. water and yeah, those mounds. <laughs> All right, show us how to do it. All right. I didn't have the best drive and I'm in the pine straw. Um, I'm still in bounds, thank God. Now this shot right here, there's water in front of the green. So I am not gonna be able to clear that with these hanging branches. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hit probably my seven iron, just kind of punch it out and let it roll up to the water and then go from there. when you're in between clubs. um so i normally play a fade so i'm gonna try to just hit a three wood that normally i'd probably hit about 240 250 i have 223 into the into the green so um really ideally i'm just trying to get over to the water i don't i'm not stressed if i if i miss hit it here and i you know have to try to get up and down but i'm gonna try to hit a three wood um the big thing is is trying to just swing easier when you're trying not to hit it as far, of course. Good tip. Um, and to also not take your swing as far back. Um, more just trying to knock it down and trying to just flight the ball a little bit better. But um, that's probably the best tip I can give as far as if you're in between clubs. Oh, you see I hit nice. the grass though? Nice. That's gonna be good though. Oh, oh, oh. oh my gosh! It almost went in! <laughs> <laughs> Tight line, folks. Yeah. Right Tight here. <laughs> so yeah, so like Meredith said, we're in a tight lie. Um, unfortunately right now when you're in the out of season times of growing grass, you're gonna get some dormant lies like this or some tight lies. Um, I recommend when you have a hill like this just to try to bank it off the hill. The downfall is the hill's kind of wet from the morning, so I'm gonna try to just hit a pitching wedge, try to bump it, and then let it run up the hill. We'll see what happens. Uh nice. Ooh. Oh, you're up there with me. All right. I don't have a ball marker with me, so you can still use a tee. Um, what I do love about these. Callaway ERC softs um, is that they have uh, three lines here that really help with putting. Um, so right now I'm reading that it's going to break probably about two to three cups to the right and it's downhill so I kind of just have to tap it and, uh, and I hope it goes in the hole. So we'll see what happens. All right, this is for Birdie. I hate these putts. <laughs> oh my oh gosh. No. Love That's hate relationship. Putt. That's a tough putt. Wide stance, okay? Yeah, wide Seriously, stance. Seriously, like when you get really close to the hole and you get in your head, just, just literally go wide. Good part. Oh. 